Are you looking for an easy way to get a high shine on your vintage sewing machine? Keep watching to find out how. The bed of this poor orphan Bradbury head is showing the signs of years of wear and tear, but hopefully I'm going to change that. I'm going to polish it with Autoglim Super Resin Polish. I've used this product for years on my cars. I have no idea why I didn't think of using this for polishing up my vintage sewing machines. Start by giving the bottle a really good shake. The polish can separate if it's been left to sit a while. Wipe all over the painted surface of your machine. I'm using a piece of old t-shirt fabric, which is perfect for this. Apply the polish quite sparingly. Autoglim Super Resin Polish is slightly abrasive, so take it easy over any decals, especially where the shellac is damaged. It contains a filler which will help reduce light scratches and swirl marks, and also contains a wax which will give a high shine. When you've finished applying the polish, let it sit until it dries to a fine haze. Then start to buff off the polish with a clean, dry, lint-free cloth. Again, old t-shirt fabric is great for this. The more you buff, the better the shine. One of the advantages of this polish is that it doesn't dry hard even when it's been left to sit for quite a while. It's always easy to buff off. It's been popular with car enthusiasts for decades and is readily available at most car stores or online. While the result after one application is not perfect, it's certainly better than before. Repeated applications will remove more scratches and increase the shine. If you try this polish out, let me know in the comments how you got on. And if you've got a favourite way of shining up your vintage sewing machines, please let us know. I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, please give it a like. And if you haven't already, please hit the subscribe button and click the bell icon to be notified of all my future uploads. As ever, thanks for watching.